I've got some uh, petrol tanks here from uh, some radio controlled airplanes. Now, I was under the impression when I got this one that the uh, the yellow bit actually well, came off, but uh, it doesn't. It's, it's glued on. So I've decided to use that for the bubbler instead. There were there were two open ports here, of which I've just put uh, a loop of tubing round, and the other tube that comes into this is something that looks very similar to this, where like uh, it's weighted and uh, it goes down to the bottom. And I thought that would make an excellent bubbler. Now uh, what I'm going to do is this other tank that I've got here has three holes in the top. Now I thought I'm going to make one as being the output for the HHR and because I've got a couple of uh, copper tubes with it I thought I'd link them together so it's still airtight and then uh, I'd use that for the uh, positive and the negative. So we've got a completely sealed unit there. Where, uh, I don't know if you can see just inside the, the two tubes there and there. So we can use them for the power in, which is great. And then uh, uh, there's another little blip there of which that at the moment isn't opened. So I just thought I'd leave it as it is. And then the output can come straight out towards the flash flashback arrester and then out to the engine. Now the engine I'm going to have mounted like that and I'm going to slowly drip some oil into the uh, what is normally the air intake just so we can get it lubricated as it's working now, uh, I've also uh, got a nice little uh, pulley on there of which we can use to try and generate electricity back out so uh, hopefully this is going to work quite well that's great then thanks for watching